Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our techies and in this video, I will gonna show you how to fix iPhone is disabled problem. So this will met this method will work in all the iPhones, iPads and iPods. So this is iPhone 6 plus in my hand, 6, 6s plus in my hand. So first of all, uh, let me tell you uh, three things so uh, which can help you to fix that problem. First, you need to use the original data cable which comes with the phone. Second, your antivirus of the uh, computer must be disabled and third, uh, your iTunes in the latest version so your uh, iTunes may be the, in the latest and must was the full video which will definitely help you to fix a problem so let me now connect it with the computer so it is so first of all let me take the data cable so this is the original data cable which comes with the phone and first connect it with the computer USB and then okay, let me connect and uh, and now uh, it's uh, connected with the phone okay. okay okay now it's connected so it's charging and and then yeah it's itunes could not detect the iphone sim key because it is locked so it will comes up so don't need to follow this uh, you need to hold the uh, power key and the home key until phone reboots it takes around 20 seconds uh, hold it for 20 seconds just like it I'm holding it for 20 seconds or 25 hardly and the phone will connect in the uh, iTunes mode so it can detect the uh, the iTunes will detect the phone so here it is it's in the iTunes mode now click over the this try again and so after that there's a restore iPhone so click over the restore iPhone and it will appear so restore and update so actually I already uh, downloaded the uh, file of the phone, the IS, uh, PW uh, file of the phone so it will directly extracting the software and if you are doing this first time you will get uh, the downloaded file. It depends upon the network speed, uh, how much your uh, network speed is. Uh, it takes around 2 or 3 hours uh, to download the file. So I already downloaded it so it's now updating. and the I'm after downloading it's I installing the driver first time so I will show you why uh, many people uh, uh, just like um, face some kind of errors just like error 3004 error 3014 error uh, 1011 these kinds of errors will appear and why in this video I will show you why so so it's installing the drivers it will takes around uh, 20 minutes I already uh, fast forward with the video you can see it it sticks or uh, this uh, driver will takes uh, install uh, take around uh, 20 minutes to install in computer and it's like uh, so it's uh, there is an error occurred is 4013 so I it's just like error why I already connect the driver the installation of drivers take so many times so it's this error will occur on the computer and after that again I will uh, I'm doing the same process holding the uh, power key and the home key software update so now it's starting the process so extracting the software as you can see it's starting And you must remember that uh, if you are if your phone's uh, iCloud lock, you must be remember the iCloud ID and the password. If you are if your phone is iCloud lock, then you uh, after this uh, restoring the phone, it will uh, ask for activation lock. So you must remember your uh, iCloud ID and the password. And that's it. So then we start it. So I'm um, now again I started holding the power key and the volume uh, power key and the home key and uh, just like phone uh, until the phone detects on the computer. 
do it as it's same if you face any error so don't be worry about that uh, you just again do try it again after updating the itunes and uh, you original with the original data cable and uh, 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 make your uh, antivirus disable so now it's again connected so restore it i'm restoring it restore and update so now it's starting the process so that's it so starting the process and if you also fa if you uh, face any problems uh, while doing that you can ask me on the comment section and you can also uh, uh, for better uh, for quick response you can ask me in the on my facebook page so i will uh, response is very fast i always uh, check my facebook page but not always on in uh, this youtube uh, creative studio so that's it uh,
now it's uh, already done so okay okay now it started so as you can see it's asking for activation lock uh, I need to provide the Apple ID and the password to unlock uh, the activate the iPhone so now uh, after doing that uh, after uh, restoring the phone that the first time the touch will uh, not work until the home key you press the home key so first you need to press the home key to open it so I already confused about that so I or tried many times to unlock the phone but it's not unlocking then I remember that a uh, first I need to press the home key so now it's unlocked so uh, the touch is now again working so I'm selecting all the settings so this is the way in that way you can easily fix uh, your iPhone is disabled problem uh, so if you like my videos so please click on thumbs up uh, and don't forget to subscribe and share my videos and you can also uh, uh, like my Facebook page and for quick response or quick uh, help you need to just uh, simply message me on my Facebook page I will quick response you so thanks for watching this